These drawings were made by children at a Hiroshima elementary school, two years after an atomic bomb destroyed the city. Their concrete school building survived, says Shizami Shigeto Minali, an American born in Hiroshima who came up with the idea for the documentary. But inside is all wood. So the inside and the building are completely destroyed. The story begins at All Souls Church in Washington, which sent the school badly needed school supplies after the bombing. The children sent back thank you notes in the form of pictures, which were stored in the church basement, largely forgotten. These students survived the bomb blast because they had been evacuated from Hiroshima. When Shizumi began her interviews in Japan, many of them did not remember the drawings. All of them remembered what they received from America, pencil, crayon, and the paper, because at the time they didn't have anything, nothing at the school. American smell, you know, Their teacher had asked them to create happy images. So that's why they draw their dream and their hope. The pictures were restored and sent back to Hiroshima to be displayed at the school in 2010. <laughs> They remembered how what happened. And because many of the people had a hard time. Mm -hmm. Shizumi thinks President Obama's visit, even if he makes no mention of the bombing, will make a difference to those who remember, like the aging students. He doesn't have to say anything, just be there is very important. Deborah Block, VOA News, Washington.